So we had two little babies. One didn't survive the first night, and the other one was Thumbelina. After about a few weeks, we had her with some other little babies, and she just didn't she didn't behave like them. She didn't play with them. She was kind of delayed in her behavior. So we thought maybe she just needed some extra time. So my wife and I are wildlife rehabbers from New York. We live in Florida now. Thumbelina has a very big personality. She uh, she makes it known what she wants. She's a little sassy. She's definitely a leader. She just turned eight years old on March 7th. Every winter during Christmas, I would make an Italian dessert called Struffoli, and they're little fried honey balls with sprinkles all over them. And Thumbelina would love them, and then one year I was making them and I had the big like bin of, of sprinkles on the counter and she kind of came up on the counter and I turned my head and the next thing I see she's basically like swimming in it. So we realized very quickly I think she liked the texture so she kind of would like roll around in them and then so that became sort of a favorite pastime. Only the Bellinas? Yeah, those are your sprinkles. Yeah, baby, those are your sprinkles. So each year for her birthday, we would always end her party with the, the, every year a bigger and bigger bowl of sprinkles for her to kind of swim in. I think it was about three years ago she started playing in the sprinkles. So every morning she kind of comes out of her little, her little nest box. She does her hair and she'll basically just stare at the refrigerator until we open up the refrigerator and give her breakfast. She gets sort of a mash, so she has sort of a vitamin mash every morning. She goes over to the living room. She has a, sort of a cat tree, and there's a little platform, and she likes to just sit in the sun for about an hour. And then she'll either play a little bit, like on the couch, she likes to hop around. and then she'll usually get a little berry, a raspberry snack. And then she'll take another nap. She likes to take naps between everything. She has a lot of nap time. She spends half of her day trying to find where the avocados are. It's her favorite thing in the world. I think she likes the, the creamy texture. She likes for us to massage her. That's. That's kind of her way of spreading her love. Then she'll actually then groom our fingertips. It's sweet. She loves her pink donut bed. It's like a, a little pet bed that's shaped like a donut. 